Hi, I'm Adam Martinetti. And I'm Mike Mooring. And we're here to talk to you today about the upcoming election in Canada and how you need to vote for the right party. The Conservative Party of Canada has a long, rich history for making those difficult, sometimes unpopular, but always necessary decisions when it comes to our flourishing economy. That's right. With your best interests at heart, the Conservative government has defunded things that we don't need anymore. Like arts and culture. F CBC. Environmental issues. F trees. And this allows them to spend money on things that we old saw Canadians love. Like, like fighter jets. jets. We know that the only greater threat to the Canadian people than gay marriage and leftist commie artsy fartsy douchebags is... Terrorism. Terrorism. Don't let this distract you from the real issue in this upcoming election. The niqab. The only reason to wear one of those in Canada is to keep your face from getting freezer burnt while you're bombing around in your skidoo. The Conservative Party is also the only political party with the balls to defund women's resources. This gives Canadian women an invaluable opportunity to become self-sufficient and resourceful on their own. And who doesn't love an independent, resourceful woman? Mm. In fact, a vote against the Conservative Party is akin to you standing up and saying that you don't believe that women can take care of themselves. And you call yourself a feminist, you lying piece of sh**! Shh. Do you hear it? That's the sound of wealth trickling down on us all. I hear it. I hear it. Oh, it's a trickling, all right. And before long, it's gonna come pouring down. A downpour of gold and riches. Golden showers, courtesy of the Conservative Party of Canada and our nation's wealthiest. Doesn't that sound nice? <laughs> I've got my mug ready to get filled. <laughs> Fill her up, boys. So this upcoming election, if you're going to vote for the Conservative Party, I'll see you at the polls. Heck, you might even notice that your ballot is pre-marked with a Conservative vote for added convenience. Huh. And if you're going to vote against the Conservative Party of Canada in this upcoming election, I invite you to stay home and tell your family why you hate Canada. You pieces of lying sh So remember, vote conservative and help keep us jobless. <sighs>